Esther Nakajigo was a Ugandan humanitarian and human rights activist who was named Uganda's ambassador of hope for women and girls by the European Union. Before her death, Nakajigo championed the fight for the rights of women, girls and underprivileged members of the community. After witnessing many of our community members struggle to access medical care, the human rights advocate sacrificed her university tuition and opened up a health center in Munyonyo named after her role model, Princess Diana of Wales. However, Nakajigo's life was cut short during a trip to the Arts National Park in the U.S. state of Colorado. The claim served on the 22nd of October in 2022 sought more than 140 million U.S. dollars in damages from the National Park Service. The family maintained that if the park employees had properly installed the gate, Nakajigo would not have been killed. On 30th January, federal U.S. Judge Berus Jenkins announced the award of 10.5 million U.S. dollars, about 38 billion Uganda shillings, for wrongful death. This is how the money will be shared amongst the family members. The husband was awarded U.S. dollars, 9.5 million. The mother of Essie, U.S. dollars, 700,000 million. And seven seven hundred thousand and her father US dollars three hundred fifty thousand on the emotional dis dis distress caused by what was really what happened to the husband. So the award to the mother was based on basic minimum of what she would have received from her daughter as support if she was still alive. Same goes to the father. Susan Nabuma, who replaced Nakajigo as the European Union Ambassador of Women and Girls, has urged all those who pledged to support the deceased project to fulfill their pledges. So I would like you friends to help me remind the European Union, which now has a new head of delegation, that EU pledged to support the maternity wing, the laboratory and the scan, and the scan room of the health centre. As it started, so that was mentioned by the European, the, by the EU ambassador during Essie's funeral. Nakajigo died at 25 while pursuing a master's degree in the U.S. Olivia Kumgisha, NTV News.